topic is successive approximation register type analog to digital converter or in short AC or ADC. First, we have to know what are the necessity of this AC or ADC. We know for other counting type ADC, conversion time varies with analog input voltage. That is, as input analog voltage increases, the conversion time is also become longer. For a large input analog voltage required long time, so there is a conversion delay problem for other counting type analog to digital converter. But in a AC or a DC, for any input voltages, may it be small or big, the required conversion time is always same. And here main circuit diagram contains one op arm, one control circuit unit, one ring take counter, one digital to analog converter. So how the operation is occur here? So to understand this ACR ADC, we first have to understand ring counter. The ring counter start counting from 1, 0, 0, 0. Okay. In the next verse, it gives 0, 1, 0, 0. The next pulse it gives 0, 0, 1, 0. And in the fourth pulse it gives 0, 0, 0, 1. And it's stop. So for four bit ring type counter, it count only four digit. Okay. Only four number. And this is 8, 4, 2 and 1. But here ring counter start with 1 0 0 0. Okay. And then all the changes will happen according to the operation or input voltages. So in the first pulse, initially as there is nothing, so here will 1 and the signal will come through this and here ring counter gives 1000 and the 1000 will come through here and convert into analog and the equivalent analog voltage is 8 volt now 8 volt will multiply it with resolution r so if resolution is 1 then 8 into 1 equal to 8 if resolution is 0 0.5 then 8 into 0 0.5 equal to 4 volt. So suppose our resolution is 0 0.5. So 8 into 0 0.5 equal to 4. Now 4 volt is here. If this 4 volt is less than input voltage, then OPAM will go to the positive saturation and it gives 1. If this voltage is greater than, if this voltage is greater than this voltage, then OPAM will go to the negative saturation and it gives 0. And for 1 and 0, I will tell you here one rule. And I can say you do not get find this rule any book in this easy or unique way which I am going to tell you. So here step number one you have to target the bits number from the MSB, MSB site according to the pulse number. Only you have to remember for first pulse you have to take or start with one zero zero zero. Then for the second pulse, you have to target second digit from the MSB side. And for the third pulse, you have to target the third digit from the MSB side. And for the fourth pulse, you have to target the fourth digit from the MSB side. 
and the second step second step is if here is one then you have to increment the digit number plus 1 if you are 0 you have to subtract 1 from the digit which is same with the pulse number if pulse number is 2 then second digit if 3 then third digit so in this way again you have to calculate here the analog input voltage and you have to compare which is the greater and according to this you have to take here 0 or 1 or you, you have to calculate and finally after 4 pulse you will get your desired correct answer now we will take an example before this you are watching DAC output is R into D I already have told you and VA greater than VF then output of comparator is 1 if VA less than VF then output of comparator is 0 SOC equal to start of conversion US equal to end of conversion look conversion and Here in this note, um, they have given uh, their own process, but I don't follow their process. Although this note is from a very recommended prestigious uh, top coaching center, but I don't follow them. I have set my own uh, technique to solve this question, and I hope uh, you will comment or uh, personally message me, whichever is uh, easier and um, you like actually more finally we get rules for SAR ADC rule 1 for first pulse counter start with initial output 1 0 0 0 always rule 2 after first pulse if pulse number is 2 3 4 then our target digit from MSB side is 2 3 4 respectively Rule 3, if op-arm output is 1, then plus 1 to the target digit and if op-arm output is 0, then minus 1 to the target digit. Rule 4, if counter is 4 bit, then end of conversion or EOC will be achieved in 4th pulse. Now we will take an example. Here. We have to convert 1.2 volt analog input into digital output. So here at first 1.2 volt is given here and according to our rule 1 for the first pulse our counter count is 1 0 0 0 okay and this 1000 will come here and convert into analog voltage 8 volt and 8 into resolution 0 0.5 here it will be 4 volt so 4 volt is here and here is 1.2 volt so this input voltage is less than this feedback voltage so this is less than this or this is greater than this voltage so op -om is negative saturation or output is zero now according to our 
second rule our bit target will be second bit from the msb side okay and as here zero we have to of uh, subtract one from the second digit from the msb side this is according to rule 3 so 1 0 0 0 and minus minus 1 so 1 0 ok and put rest as it was and now our output reading is 0 1 0 0 so 1 0 0 ok so 1 0 0 equivalent analog voltage is 4 4 and into 0 0.5 equal to 2 now here will be 2 volt now here will be 2 volt ok so this 2 volt and here 1.2 volt so uh, now analog input is less than this feedback voltage so also this time the comparator will go to the negative saturation or comparator output will be zero so as this is third pulse our target will be third digit from the msb side and uh, we have to uh, subtract minus one from the third digit as our output is zero so here minus one okay so our calculation is one zero zero and here zero okay now the count is one zero one zero mean two so two into zero one five is one now this time this feedback voltage is less than this input voltage or input voltage is greater than feedback voltage so comparator will go to the positive saturation or output will be one so one and uh, one and for the one we have to target the fourth digit plus one okay so here plus one plus one so our final count is one one zero zero okay so our final count is one one sorry zero zero one one so digital output of analog input 1.2 volt is zero zero one one and counting process will be stop uh, after fourth pulse okay so that is the final answer now one final example here analog input is 6.3 volt and resolution is 0 0.25 so in the first pulse our ring counter output will be 1 0 0 0 ok now the equivalent of 1 0 0 is 8 analog voltage and 8 into 0 0.25 equal to 2 2 will be the output of DAC or 
the feedback voltage will be 2. So as analog input is 6.3 volt and feedback voltage is 2, so it's clear that input voltage is greater than feedback voltage. So comparator will go to the positive saturation and output of comparator will be 1. So according to our first and second rule, our target will be second digit in the second pulse and as in the second pulse our output is operator output is 1. So we have to uh, do plus 1 in the second digit. Okay. So plus 1 to the second digit. So 1 and rest will be as it was. So our now count is 1100 from the MSB to LSB side. So equivalent of 1100 is 12. Okay. And so uh, our now analog voltage is 12 and 12 into 0 0.25. 12 into 12 into 0 0.25 equal to 3. Okay. So 3 voltage will be here as a output of DAC or feedback input. Okay. 3 volt. Now this is 3 volt and this is 6.3 volt. So this time also VA greater than VF. So up, uh, up arm or comparator will go to the positive saturation and here will be 1. So in the third pulse also we have to increment in the third digit plus 1. So <coughs> plus 1 here. So now 1 and rest will be as it was ok so now the count and in the fourth part so uh, our count is now 14 14 analog voltage so 14 into uh, 0 0.25 equal to 3.5 now this time also our analog input is uh, greater than feedback voltage so uh, here will be 1 as a output of operator and it will go through the control unit and come here and according to our rule we have to increment in the fourth pulse to the fourth digit plus 1 ok so plus 1 and equal to 1 and rest will be 1 1 1 so our final count is 1 1 1 1 ok and state diagram also here depicted that you are watching from start of conversion to end of conversion it was 1 0 0 0 0 1 0 0 1 1 1 0 and then 1 1 1 1 and end of conversion and so 1 1 1 1 is our desired answer as a digital output of analog input voltage 6.3 voltage